No access to my money. None. The Five Star Bank on West State Boulevard was busier than normal. The parking lot was full as customers waited in line, many waiting for nearly an hour. I didn't want to wait. I heard somebody say they were waiting for 45 minutes. Um, I'm not prepared to do that today. Trying to get answers. They had computer glitches and they didn't have their system up and running at 9 o'clock this morning. Barbara Lauer is frustrated with the transition to Flagstar. The debit cards didn't work from Friday till Monday. People are still not having debit cards work. She was at the bank twice today trying to get her money. They just told us outright they didn't have our money. So we just left. I mean, they came along the line and said, if you're here for Social Security checks, sorry, we don't have your money. After an hour and 50 minutes, they told me that None of the pension checks would be in until late this afternoon. Steve Walker was able to get his check around four this afternoon. Everybody's doing the best they can. No, you just getting upset about it. Yeah. It's not their fault. No. Not my fault. <laughs> it's just something you have to put up with. 200,000 Wells Fargo customers in Indiana, Ohio, Michigan, and Wisconsin are affected by the change. In a statement, Flagstar says most customers haven't had any issues, but some issues are expected as the change takes effect. Flagstar goes on to apologize for the inconvenience. Just be patient. It all gets better. But for Lauer, it's too late. Well, I have my money, but I won't be back. <laughs> I won't be back.